Hello everyone, I'm meteorologist Peter Sherwood in the WRAL Severe Weather Center. A strong high pressure ridge will continue to dominate our weather, especially as we head into the weekend. This ridge is going to continue to build and allow us to see some record warmth move in. So get ready for it. It's going to feel unseasonable for this time of year with those warm temperatures working their way in. We are going to make it to around 70 eight degrees today, 80 degrees tomorrow. We should typically see temperatures in the lower 70s and that's certainly not going to be the case over the next five days. We're talking about 85 degrees actually on Saturday. I wanna show you the record numbers because we're gonna be close to it on Friday. 82 is a forecast high, record of 87. We won't shatter that record number. 85 on Saturday, the record high is 86 degrees and then 84 for the high temperature on Sunday, that record is 83 degrees. So we are going to see a lovely warm up move in, but we could potentially be heading into record category across our region. Now we're going to see a big switch with our conditions on Halloween, we're expecting a high temperature of 64 degrees. Temperatures are going to fall throughout the day due to a cold front moving through. And because we're going to get a cold front across our area, we could potentially see breezy conditions and there's a chance of rain. Now, models are uncertain with the timing and our rain chances. We are going to continue to watch that because some models have it dry for trick-or-treating hours while we are still seeing some rain in the forecast. We still can't rule that out. We're still a week away from Halloween, so keep checking back. We are likely to see temperatures fall throughout the day as well. Around trick-or-treating time, we can see readings in the lower 60s as well as the 50s and about a quarter of an inch of rainfall or less will be possible. Again, stay tuned to the forecast and keep checking back. We're going to continue to get updates from our computer models and we'll let you know what to expect and we'll fine tune the data as we get closer and closer. Otherwise, beyond that, temperatures are expected to plummet. We could potentially be dealing with some of the coolest air of the season so far with the below normal temperatures moving in as we head into the beginning of November. Otherwise, today is going to feel amazing outside. Get out there. We're heading to 72 degrees at 178 for the high temperature. And then as we head into this evening, we're looking at those temperatures in the 60s. We do expect lows in the 50s tonight leading into tomorrow morning. It's not going to be as chilly as this morning. We're down to 53 degrees in Raleigh, 51 in Southern Pines, and 55 for Clinton. Our seven-day forecast expressing that that big warm up that's going to move in. We're at 85 degrees on Saturday, but it's North Carolina during our fall months. We see drastic changes and by Tuesday, we could potentially see those high temperatures right there in the 60s.